right guys the moment that you have all been waiting for the setup tour Eww, i'm so excited right look let's let's just start this off these foam things that you can buy off Amazon look okay, but they are rubbish. They don't do what they're supposed to do. They haven't retracted any sort of kind of sound from the room. I've spoke to my neighbors. They can still hear me. So it's like, I've definitely got to look into other options. If there is any other options, give me a little message in the comments. Right, first thing I'm going to show you guys. This was bought by one of my followers. They thought, you know what? You're such a celebrity and such an amazing person in our eyes. We want to get you your own plaque, even though I'm not a music artist. But yeah, as you can see, Richard's little secret, dirty little secret. Big up to the RLS for doing that one, man. I appreciate you. And they even went to the extent of actually getting me like a Hollywood plaque as well. <laughs> oh, I love you guys, man. Big up to the RLS. So, yeah, um, I tried to do like a little design, obviously, with the um, sounding foam. Yeah, it looks pretty crap. I know. I don't, I'm not even going to deny it. So, we have got, I think they're like $15.99 for the LED lights. They literally stick onto the back wall, guys. They are literally so easy to put up. Um, and I'm not going to lie, my sounding foam um, is literally ruining the look of the room at the moment. I'm not happy with it whatsoever, but it is what it is. Um, moving on down here, we have got my training collection. So as you can see, I'm trying to give you the best angle. Um, I'll show you my, 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 my two favorite pairs. Obviously, I've got my Aqua Jordans, which I wear absolutely loads. And then I've got like, these painted on Air Forces that were based at the bottom. Really love those two pair of trainers. Great little purchases. I think the Jordans were like 180 and then the Air Forces were like 70, I want to say. So not, not expensive, not, especially with Jordans. And some Jordans at the moment are like 400. No, thank you. And as we move down to the middle of the office, this is probably one of my favorite purchases. The Nano Lights are very popular on YouTube and for any streamers. I wanted a good backdrop. So when I was streaming, I wanted something colorful. I wanted something noticeable. And I feel like these kind of took, these took the win for me. But I will be honest, this for the 12 set, I think was like £169. So they are so expensive, guys. They're really easy to put up. If you can afford them, great. But there are definitely are some alternatives, especially in regards to the LED side, especially if you don't want to spend the money. Moving on very swiftly, we have my hat rack. I don't wear hats anymore, but I thought, you know what? I have spent a little bit of money back in the day on hats, like a couple of hundred quid. The least that I could do was keep them. Obviously, we've got some of the Fresh Ego Kid, which is all I used to wear, as you can see under there. Some of them are my old merch that I used to do, and there is merch that's going to be dropping by the time this video is released. As you can see, the foam is done terribly, guys, but it is what it is. I'm going to move on and try and get it sorted soon, I hope. Moving swiftly on, what do we have here? Oh, my, yeah. Any streamer or anyone that does YouTube or long hours needs a mini fridge and needs Red Bulls. Big up to Vix for purchasing this for me. I love you and I appreciate everything you do. Um, quick little lava lamp, obviously, that Dory got me. I'm not going to lie. This thing lights up ridiculous when it's literally... Look at this. Look, the foam's coming apart, guys. Look what's going on. This is just shocking. If anybody's actually really good at doing stuff like this or any soundproofing, please can you DM me on Instagram, Richard Sales Official, and just let me know what I've done wrong. Cool. So here we have got probably one of my most favourite bean bags. I'm not even gonna lie, I literally would sleep in this. Like the amount of times I've come off stream and I've just sunk straight into it. I'm just like, I love you. But yeah, so obviously the lights go all around the room, guys. Obviously, the sun over there is quite stopping that part of it. But you know what? Forget all these other bits. The main reason why you guys are here is to see this. just had to let some music embrace that moment because this is something i'm so proud of and you know why i'm really proud of this guys i built all of this myself i literally did the majority of this from scratch and i never thought that i had the patience to build anything like this so i'm so so proud of myself 
We've got um, we've got my mic sort of this just sort of kind of like attached. I'm not gonna lie, the the cable management at the bottom could be better, but I am really really happy. The big thing at the bottom there is for what I rest my feet on when I'm gaming. And yeah, this is what the gaming setup looks like, guys. I am gonna go and take you through some of the items just to let you know how much stuff costs because you know what, there are a lot of people that are looking into streaming at the moment, and I'm not gonna lie to you, I completely get it. But what I want to warn you off is, is there are cheaper options and I do want to kind of make sure that you guys don't go and spend stupid money just in case there is a cheaper option because they all do do the same things. Just some of the name brands and the higher sort of kind of ended products do a little bit more. So let's get back into the stream. The stream? <laughs> the video? Sorry. So I'm going to sit down on my, I think it's called, um, I think it's called like S. Is it ST Meng? I think I don't know what it is, but I saw it and I thought, you know what? It looks really, really cozy. Let's just have a little look, sees. But yeah, no, it's good and it's ridiculously comfortable. So, sitting down, we have got the Magic Eagle, Eagle mouse and keyboard that came as a set. I think it was like 30 or 40 quid. I don't actually remember. And I got the mouse mat, obviously, which is LED as well. And obviously, colors go around it. When it is dark here at night time, this looks amazing. Um, I've just bought this screensaver because I thought, you know what? That looks so cool. That looks similar to my room with all the colors obviously minus the bed and all the other stuff but i liked it um so yeah i went with the ben q monitors you can get these on amazon for like 130 pound i was already spending i was already spending like a ridiculous amount of money and i thought to myself you know what let me just get decent screens that will do the job and they literally do the job and that's the truth so um obviously i know you guys have seen one of these obviously i've got the plug at the bottom like if I wanted to sort of kind of just change the lights, etc., it just changes the lights, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, they're like 15 quid on, on Amazon to get the LEDs, I'm not gonna lie. PS5 controller, I think we all know how much PS5 costs. I've got my PS5 at the bottom at the moment because I do stream on console at the moment. Um, camera that I use for vlogging at the moment is, again, what I saw in a Sidemen video, the G7X, I think Mark Triple I. It is okay, it is okay, it's a good camera. Like, do you know what I mean? It's It's got great sort of kind of quality and stuff like that. But I'm not going to lie. It overheats so quickly. It's not good. It's not sort of kind of really good for like, um, for like YouTube videos and stuff like that. So I just wouldn't, I wouldn't, yeah, you, you, you guys know, you guys know. I just wouldn't, I wouldn't. I wouldn't recommend it if you wanted to film like 40 minute YouTube videos. It's great for vlogging if you're doing bits here and there, but it's not good for filming long videos. A lot of you might know what this is. It's an Elgato stream deck. Basically, it's just shortcut buttons to do stuff that you want to do when you're on stream. So if you forget to record on Streamlabs or you forget to press stream on Streamlabs or you want to send a tweet, blah, blah, blah. It helps you out with all of that. Sorry, let me try and get an angle so you guys can see the buttons. So you've got the Twitter, the view count and all that jazz. That cost about, I can't even remember, I think that was like 130 quid and it was ridiculously expensive, but I know, I know that I'm going to use it. So, moving across, already explained that obviously the keyboard came with a mouse. This right here is a Razer capture card. If you did ever want to stream on console in regards to your Xbox and your PS5, PS4, you will need one of these because basically what it is, um, it also lets you stream in 4K, but even though obviously on Twitch 4K is never really recommended, obviously because I think I think is it 1080p is what most streamers would stream on. Um, but yeah, check this out if you wanted to stream on PS5, they're amazing. When I figured this out, I actually realised how good it is. It does overheat a little bit, but that just depends on how long you actually stream for. Um, I bought one of these, which is just sort of like a little extra USB connector if I had any games and stuff like that. So, like, I've got some other things, like if I wanted to charge my phone and stuff, this is pretty awesome to just have by my side. But I actually got bought something a long time ago. Oh, I forgot about this. Hold on. So this is my little globe that changes colours. I think this is pretty cool. I actually really like this. Um, uh, and it's just really, it's just really good. You know, you can change it to different things that you want. But this here is what I bought. So it charges, it charges my phone, my AirPods, and my Apple Watch all at the same time, and it's amazing. Like, and it, honestly, you can get these for like 20 quid on Amazon, and they're the best thing ever. Um, moving on, we've got the Elgato key lights. Anybody that knows about these, these are very, very expensive. I think they're like 120 quid per light. But the lighting that you get from it is ridiculous. Like, I'm not even, like, obviously, when you're streaming, people being able to see you is huge. It's huge. So, I would check these out. But you can get cheaper options. But I just thought, like, these were the best ones. I'm not going to lie. Like, I really like them. And there's an app where you can actually control the lighting as well. Um, obviously, I already explained to you about the footrest. The footrest wasn't very expensive. I think that was, 
about 20 quid, but it was definitely, definitely worth the money. Um, then we go on to the AWD Gamer PC. The reason why I got it is, again, it was LED orientated, and that's kind of the look that I'm going for in the room. As you can see, obviously, you've got the actually interior of the hard drive in here, and I just love that. I, know, I don't know too much about computers, but I just love the way that this looked, and it's so quiet. You literally can't hear anything from it. I'm not even joking. My mini fridge makes more noise than this, but this is unbelievable. Obviously, I've got a toner mic here. Every, there's probably a lot of streamers that use these. They, you can get like a lot of different mics in regards to your Razer, your Elgato's, but I really like this. It's really simple. Um, it's quite clear and the quality is great. So, um, and what's good, obviously, it just adjusts. You can just sort of kind of move it around and obviously it just clamps onto the side of your table. Um, I'm trying to think what else I want to show you. Obviously, I've got a lot of things in regards to like, like extra sort of kind of extensions and stuff like that, but you need that because I've got two, I've literally got two BT um, boosters at the moment because I needed something for an Ethernet cable for my PS5 and for the PC at the same time so I can stream both. So it's been pretty, pretty intense. But yeah, guys, I'm going to give you sort of like, I'm going to just do like a last minute sort of kind of like, um, silent little view of the room just so you guys didn't miss it and then I'll come back and just end the video so yeah this is my setup tour I appreciate all of you guys tuning in and yeah let's just get back to the last bit so here we go